Hi YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm filming using the natural light and I'm not sure if it's too dark or not, um, but I'll, I'll just go with it. It's a really nice sunny day, um, so um, hopefully we won't have too, too much light changes. Uh, getting that out of the way, uh, I've got a very exciting video. I wasn't meant to film it, I'm going on holiday tomorrow. Uh, and I'm super excited, um, but I've uh, ordered a little thing that is in this box and um, there's a story behind it because it's a handbag, but it's not a handbag investment handbag. It's still an investment because um, it's not the cheapest um, of um, things I've ever bought but it's not something that I spent hundreds of pounds hundreds of pounds on so um just to just to give you a background and um, I wanted a cold Gaia bag for about a year and a half um and last year when I tried to buy it or when I wanted to buy it it was sold out and um this year they brought it in so many different styles and so many different um materials and, and, and textures and, and shapes um, I was debating and debating I was putting it off putting it off putting it off and um, just a few days before my holidays um, I decided well I want I really want this bag and I really want to take it with me and um, so I've managed to sort out the delivery which was the Saturday delivery and it arrived this morning and I thought before I go anyway I'm just going to show you what I've got inside um can you see I'm sure you can see so anyway just getting into unboxing that's the most exciting part which way is it this way Seems to be like loads of unboxing lately, but I really, it's not the best unboxing, but I haven't really been shopping that much, so, um, so yeah, so wow, look at this, this is really a crap unboxing, look at that, that's quite cool, Selfridges, so as you can see, I bought it in Selfridges, I wanted to originally buy it uh, from the net porter there was one or two items that I had my eyes on but um it was available and then the day I was wanting to buy it it, it was sold out so I did manage to buy it from there so that's an invoice and obviously return if I don't like it and that's how it came packed so that's quite nice there's some um cardboard or some paper here and then that is an actual bag so that is a box empty and that is a that is a handbag wow so it's got its own little dust bag and then there is a box inside this is small this is seriously small. I thought it will be bigger. This is, um, well, you're going to see what that is. But this is small. Really, really small. I, I don't think I've seen it in person. That's an interesting thing. I think that's the only, one of the few things that I've ever bought that I haven't seen in person. I always saw it. Oh. I always saw it online. Okay, so that is what it is. Okay, they really, they really like it's like perfect fit into the box. Oh dear, let me get it out. Not damage. So I'll show you the box first. So obviously it's a. It's a brand um, box called Book Gaia Box. And what's this? This is, um, so this is called Gaia Arc Bag. This is unique bamboo Gaia Arc Bag handmade by skill artisan. Reaching in the bamboo expected and what you, what the make piece unique. Perfectly imperfect, enjoy, hashtag called Gaia. I'm definitely going to post it on my Instagram, but that is a bag. Oh my goodness! So, 
So it's obviously got um, a cold Gaia on here. And then the handles fall like this. Can you see? And then you just grab it as a, as a top handle bag. It's quite cool. Um, you can see, and this is something because I have not seen this back in person. So this is something that I have not um, anticipated or realized. It's got, uh, it's got sort of a threading. Can you see? It's got like a um, pieces of plastic to stitch it all together. So that goes here, and that's the other side as well. Um, so that's the tag and then if I hold it like this that is how it looks like um right first impressions as um I really like it but it's really really quite something different for me it's very yeah it's just uh, my husband is going to say oh my goodness have you lost your mind uh, i do really like it i really really do like it and um, if this video goes up after my trip um, and i take some pictures with the bag i'm going to insert it obviously so um you might have you know one or two um styling ideas as well but my first impressions are yeah i really like it um it is it's not small it's well i think it's a decent size you can definitely put your so it opens like so you can see it and then it's got like one big compartment obviously um what what, why I was hesitating so much is just the gaps between each of the bamboo um, sticks are quite, um, you know, more or less the same size as the, the thickness um, of, of the bamboo itself. So obviously you cannot put anything very loose in there. But if you were to put your um, card, uh, your credit card, obviously it's going to fall um the same with the card holder. If it's if it's like a really fine thin one, and you've got one or two cards, it's it's going to go as well. So you have to be mindful of it. But if you're putting your phone in a cover, and then your your wallet, your sunglasses, obviously it is quite safe, and nothing that's going to fall out. Um, it is a see-through bag though. Um, so what I will probably do, I will um put my um maybe my phone and my possessions or my belongings that I don't necessarily want it to be seen in maybe sunglasses um, uh, cover or the you know material cover so nothing that I don't want to see being on display will be on display and um, so that's just the way um, this bag is but I have to say I'm really happy I'm really happy about it it's such a cute little bonkers thing but I just absolutely love it um yeah it it since it it was originally released um it comes in different um different materials as well so there is a mother of pearl and you can buy um like light pink and i think there is a, a emerald green there is a beautiful tortoise shell one um, and i really like it and as well there are different styles so they open differently they're like um like a bucket bags and then uh, yeah there's so many for styles i think this is a classic and um i'm all about classic shapes classic handbags classic colors and um i think that's what makes my wardrobe quite versatile and i wanted a classic one as well the um the arg bag because this is an, a medium of and this is a small one there's a smaller version and there's a larger one and i think the, this the me small one is quite small and maybe you know I wouldn't say I regret I got this one, but if I got a size bigger, that would be fine. The mini, I think, would be too small. Uh, but yeah, I absolutely, absolutely love it. I don't know how durable that bag is, and maybe in few 
few months um, after the summer is over and you know I've been away or you know I've used that bank a um, fair bit I will be able to give you a better um, overview of how it's performed and how it's hold its shape and structure and if there's any damage um, but it does seem quite a fragile bag I'm not going to lie when I hold it it's very light though very very light um, and as well the the imperfection that they were talking about is you can see that there are some different colors or discoloration on on the bamboo and i think again i don't particularly mind it so absolutely love it and uh, this one retails for i think about 150 pounds you can get it slightly cheaper but that's usa and then you pay have to pay the customs as well um so um so yeah really pleased really pleased um that's it Thank you very much for watching. I'm not going to make it any any longer and I can see my battery is going to die as well in a minute. So yeah, thanks for watching and uh, I hope you like it and leave me any questions you've got and I'll try to get back to you. Subscribe and like and, and uh, see you in my next vlog. Bye!